One of the common things that we do when we are not well is to lie like this, which we call it a supine position. When we have an infection in the lung, and the infection is there for more than a day or two, most of the lungs which are on the lower part of the body, that is the which are dependent part that we call, that is where the infection is predominant and fluid accumulation can occur. What we have learned from other places in China, Europe and USA is this position is not helpful for a patient who is hypoxemic or having a COVID infection. Various positions have been recommended. One of them is putting the prone position, that is on the sleeping on the belly. Now our nurse is going to show you, Dinesh is going to show you how to do prone position. Dinesh, you want to turn and lie prone? You can see now, he is lying on his belly and he is keeping his face straight, you can keep it face straight or turn to one side. What happens with this is, the part of the lungs is a bit filled with fluid, they start to get air. As a result, the lungs starts to cope with this infection much better. So you can see, he is completely prone, this is a prone position. And the other alternative sometimes is trying to lie on the side. Can you go to lie on one side? You can lie on one side for some time and then lie on the other side for some time. So in this phase, every part of the lung is getting very And you want to turn the other side? If you are awake and able to cope with it, this is not a bad thing at all. But in which you lie supine for some time, lying prone for some time, lie on each side of the lung. You can easily divide it to half an hour each or one hour each so that all the parts of the lungs are ventilated properly and it also affects the perfusion of the lung. So it's a combination of both ventilation and perfusion, what we breathe it and how the blood is circulating around the lung. Thank you.